Indeed, I'll be chatting with Mbahu Mohini, yes. president of NJAC, and uh -huh. uh, Thursday's the 50th anniversary mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. the March to Karani, mm -hmm. and we will be talking about that this morning. Yes. So, good morning. Yes, across the room. On this side, <laughs> yes, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> So as I jump across to my next interview here, good morning, Sue. Good morning. I know you're very um, cautious about shaking hands <laughs> here this morning as well. I'm so we'll, we'll keep the uh, we'll keep the safe distance. Okay. <laughs> but thank you for being here this it's morning. It's a pleasure. Mm -hmm. Now, um, is it like first of all, it's not Mbahu. Mbahu. Mba Mbahu. There's no H there. I see. I see. I thank see you. they put in the age, but there's no age there. Mbau, thank you. Thank you for and the And um, given the time that we have, I, I think we could just focus on the, the march to Karani and Kufu. All right. Okay, because there was some other things at the 26th. But when, when I realized it's only seven minutes, I need a little attitude to put things into perspective. And I would want to see, because we just something very brief about His ex Excellency Chief Silver Makandal Daga and, um, and the history that is so important for the young people to understand. So I just wanted to introduce these two books. Definitely. I would have liked to introduce this, but I I'm not sure I have enough time. All right. So let's go into the <coughs> March, which is on the 26th. What does... No, 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 no. Today is the 12th of, Mar of March. Today is the anniversary of Today is the anniversary, but yeah. the is there a commemoration of it on a different day? We are commemorating the Trinidad Tobago Revolution, which was for the whole year. Right. <coughs> one of the major events we have would be a two-day conference up at the Univ University of the West Indies, which is do being done jointly with Salisis. Um, that is on the 20th and the 21st of April. All right. And what, what is the topics that are you going to ventilate for those uh, conferences? <laughs> to be honest about it, I, I am on the committee, but um, I don't even know. I can't, we can't, I can't go into the topics because... They handling topics, we handle topics. Well, let's go into the history a little bit. And you what I'll be dealing more with, with is 1970 specifically, as it relates to the march to Karni, because it was more than a march. It was a march with a purpose. And what was the purpose of it? To the unite march? Africans and Indians for national unity. It was a national unity march. And there were a lot of, for example, his, his grace at that time, Archbishop Anthony Pantin, promised a march. But there were those. Because we were engaged in a movement against the colonial structures that, that were still in involved, they put a lot of, of pressure on him not to go. He withdrew, apologized, and um, the U.S. Now, for the commemoration of this march, uh, as you rightly mentioned, it was a march to unify the the peoples. Yes, and to eradicate the racism that has that was so embedded and is once again embedded in our country where people vote so much on the basis of race. Uh, in 70, we were able to, to a large extent, eliminate that racial approach to politics and move it from the realm of race to the realm of nation building. What do you think we need to do in this day and age, you know, in the society that we have here in Trinidad and Tobago now to really push that mantra of unity amongst the people. Can, can something like this happen again, it where can, we can unite? It can, because it happened before 1970, um, during Butler's period, uh, where, for example, Kula Rienzi, who was an Indian, virtually um, um, caretakered Butler's union until he came back out from prison. And when he came back, he handed it back to him. Right. So back in those days, there was that greater sense of unity. But what happens is that for political gain, parties engage in race politics. And unfortunately, uh, we are unfortunately out of time. We, we do have to take a, a break, a short break, and come back with more. I want to thank you, Mbau, for joining us this morning. We're going to take a short break and come right back. Stay with us.